1907, Mrs. Hamada reading Javanshir's Felita named to foreign and Muslim women in the magazine Mola Nusreddin changed her life. Only after it, she agreed to marry with the author of the Philitan, Mirza Jalil. Mirza Jalil Mehmed Gulzadeh was a true Azerbaijani and educator. After graduating from Gori Seminary in 1887, he went to Shusha and met with Kurshin Banu Natavan. He struggled against ignorance, prejudice, illiteracy and satire. He had always fought for the rights of the nation, especially for women. In 1890 to 1907, he was a supervisor at the Neyram school and he increased the number of students to 40. With his efforts, a class of girls was organized at the same school and his sister Sakina and eight other Azerbaijani girls were involved in education there. He preferred his mother tongue over all languages. A unique message to Russian and Persian speakers was like this, forgive me for speaking Turkish in my native language. He is the founder of Mola Nesreddin Literary School. In 1906, he began publishing the magazine Mola Nesreddin and laid the foundation of satirical journalism in Azerbaijan and throughout the Turkic Muslim world. He wanted to influence the illiterate population through the use of cartoons and to encourage the nation to think. The genius such as Mirza Alekber Sabir was introduced by Mola Nesreddin magazine. Although he knew Quran and religion very well, he was against the prejudice and the arbitrariness of the officials. Radical clerics and officials whom he criticized put money on his head. Therefore, his brother Mirza Alekber, who took part in the Sadar Khan movement, took Mirza Jalil to Tabriz. He lived in Tabriz during 1920 to 1921. There, he struggled to publish Mola Nesreddin magazine in Azerbaijani. When the official circles refused, he ironically said, the Armenian publishes three magazines in their own language. Then let me publish the magazine in Armenian. After this mockery, permission was granted and eight issues of the magazine were published in Iran. All the brothels in Tabriz at the time were closed immediately following the harsh criticism of Mola Nesreddin magazine. In 1921, he arrived in Baku in 1921 on the invitation of the Soviets. Nariman Narimanov donated keys of the apartment in the city centre to him, and Mola Nesreddin magazine continued to work there. But as a result of censorship, the magazine began to gain more of a Soviet image. In fact, his great literary legacy was created during the 1920s. Mirza Jalil categorically objected to the proposal to rename the magazine Mola Nesreddin to Godless. He was not a disbeliever, and when he first presented the magazine to society in the early 20th century, he said, I came for you, my Muslim brothers. Mirza Jalil Mamad Gulzadeh, our Azerbaijani. 